Minimize that. We are here! We are back! Woohoo! I am feeling better. Yesterday, I honestly was struggling to get up and about still. Um, but that was tiredness, not the cold. The cold is basically gone at this point. Um, mostly. Uh, but also, I'm... Well, also, you know, chronic fatigue syndrome. I was very... Uh, can barely get up and move around and all that jazz. Which sucked ass. Sucked ass. And I wanted to, you know... No, I wanted to finish that sentence, I guess. Let's check the sound levels from this jaunty tune. Cables in there properly. La 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 la. Cool, that's on. And I'm getting some audio. How are we sounding? Everyone good? Maybe I've turned up the volume on my own a lot. I have actually, I think. There we go. Put it in my half. So Muffman went well. Is this actually my first stream since then? I thought I'd done. I thought I'd done one since then. Yes, went incredibly well. I I can hear you, it's fine. Thank you so much. Uh, yeah, Mothman went incredibly well. Actually, if I can... Literally, like, seconds ago, I got a delivery, and it's a wig! Uh, I wanted to invest in a wig that I could, like, customise and do shit with. And How's Your Head Wigs, UK-based, we're having a sale. Kind of talked about it, but the vids hadn't been shared yet then. Ah, yes, 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 yes. Uh, so yes, I have shared the vids now, and they went really well. So we have a bundle, Zweft, uh, which I can use to extend the thing. And I got that because on the very cheap, they were having a, a big old sale of some colours that weren't super popular. Hedwig, yeah, yeah. There we go, yeah. How's your head, wig? Haven't had any complaints. Then I have this ooh, purple bag. I'll start the game shortly. <laughs> People who came here for the game. Oh, ooh, ooh. I knew the color was going to be a little weird. Uh, it's so big. This is a large wig. Kind of an olive tone, like a, a blondy green. An olivey green. Can you say I love my pasta? And the cantankerous 2.54 centimeters. Yeah, and it's dark rooted, which is really cool, because like, at the bottom it's just like nice and green. It's a lot brighter than it looks on the camera. Ooh, I'm interested in seeing what I can do with her. I'm very tempted to, um... There's a label inside that just says, Give Head. <laughs> That's so funny. Very excited to see what I can do with this lady. Ooh, this is so... It's so full and so big. Like, I've had a cheap wig before, so it's very nice to have a wig that retails at much more. I got it for ten pounds. Apparently this colour was quite unpopular. So much hair, I can cover the screen. Wowza. Okay. So yeah, I got that. I'm very tempted, because I'm enjoying a lot of 60s inspired uh, looks. Gotta have a wiggy intermission. <laughs> uh, yeah, I, I was very tempted to do something beehive -y with it. Uh, and I've seen online you can do beehive wig with a, 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 a Coke bottle. A, one of those two liter soda bottles. So I'm very interested in seeing if I can do that. Okay, uh, for the me editing later. Hello! <laughs> uh, when we last left our heroes, we'd gone to the part where we can make our own freaking crew! So excited. Ooh, I have a crew list now. So I have a helmsman. Uh, Lawrence, I'm just doing it for the money. Uh, I'm dark. 
Polly! Oh, welcome to my place. I'm the cook. And I just... Oh, hang on. Sails the ship for a steep price. He will increase your ship's quick. Oh, interesting. Yeah, they have stats. So he has 30 quick. Polly doesn't have stats, but using the crew command, she'll replenish one character's MP. Ooh. And Marco! Oh... I'm very happy to be out of there now. Using crew rule command, you will double all of your spirit points for one turn. Wow, sir! Got to recruit them all, part of the program. Yeah, got a fancy boat. Very excited. Ooh, that's so cool! Okay. We just got here and rested. Discovered we've been named Vice the Valiant, which is lovely. Exchanged a bunch of fish. Sadly here, there's an area surrounded by sky rocks and sky rifts. Hmm. Probably make some discoveries in the area if you have a, a ship that can go through those. Well, unfortunately, they have given me the nice shiny ship. But I need to go uh, reacquire the ability to go through certain rifts. And whatnot. Yes, so we had escaped Valua. After reacquiring the... Oh, it's a quest log. Equip and collect a crew in places you can finally get back to now. Yes! That's the plan! Uh, however, I believe the story wants me to go to... Um, Crescent Isle. Does he want to join the crew? He looks like he's happy here. Where does the salt blast a huge hole in the gate of the Grand Fortress? Oops. They're saying the same guy who escaped from Valor is the one responsible! Man, it's so incredible! I love the ground! So weird. Love it. Let's have a little look see around here, see if there's anyone. Are you recruitable? No, you're a box. Okay. So yes. Uh when we last left our heroes! We had reacquired the uh red and green crystals that have been taken by Valua. Cham! Yes! Love that! Well, that's not what I wanted, but I, I will happily accept it. Yes. Uh, Enrique, the prince, who is sick of his uh, mother being... You know, a dictator and an asshole. Still keep all spike. That's fine. Take a jam, take a jam, take a jam, take a jam, take a chain jump, man! Take a jam's on me. Uh, yeah, we were in a balloon prison. We broke out of the balloon prison. Everyone was sexist and shitty to finer. Didn't enjoy that part. We got rid of Gilda, who was, you know, a big old pseudo Casanova. Wants to sex all the women, but has commitment issues. What a dickbag. Oh! That's Loose Cannon... That guy. I need to bear that in mind. Well! Someone that has a unique avatar. Do you want to take a guess? If he's available as crew? Ah, so you finally have your very own ship, huh? Maybe it'll make things easier for, uh, for both of us if I just go with you. Oh, that was quick. Pinta has joined your crew as a delegate. What? What, is, what does that even mean? <laughs> Using crew command, he will protect your ship from enemy cannon fire for a full turn. Ooh! Cool. What's a delegate? What's a delegate do? Pinta, like Nina, Pinta, and Santa Maria. Oh, the three boats of uh, that guy. Yeah, I'm here at your definitely not a kink shop looking at all those collars in the background. And where did you get X attack and armor from? Ooh, it's a lot of will. Oh, Drachma. I'm sure at some point we'll remember his existence and bring him up. It's kind of weird that no one has so far. That's not the 
out button. There we go. Okay. Most weapons are made with moonstones. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm aware of that. Thank you, though. <clears throat> what a big smile. Welcome to my sexy dungeon place. Missed it because you was asleep, but Valen did the invisible fashion show yesterday. Oh my god, I just saw about that. I just saw about that afterwards. That looked like a, a, a delightful approach. Uh, in a green morph suit, he was able to show off his collection of sexy lingerie, which is blah, marvelous. Vice the Valiant. Inferior cannons cannot be equipped. Damn. Oh, but I don't have any normal uh, accessories. Oh, these are very cheap. Hang on. So I definitely don't have any of the other accessories I had before, right? Can I go to Nassar and... Uh, there we go, yeah. I oh no, I do have them. Brilliant, brilliant, brilliant. Okay, sweet. Print figure, rogue figure, magic defense, more magic defense, a floor heater. This advantage of the heat to keep living quarters nice and comfortable. It increases magic by what? Magic defense by one. It just sounds nice. Print figure. God, I missed that I had this here in the entire time. Turbo kit increases good quick and dodge chance. Oh, but bore up kid is just better. Okay. And steel deck will increase defense. I guess one of each then. I feel like the floor heater might unlock dialogue or something. Well, hey there, handsome. I heard about you, Vice the Valiant. You seem like quite a troublemaker. Oh, they get more items because of new trade routes opening up. That makes sense. Oh, chom! You can just buy choms! That's really interesting. So I can use that to spit up all the chams that I've taken. Uh, and then... Brain. Oh, is that room crystal? That, that sounds very useful, actually. I've got so much money. Do you have any money? I want to spend all your money at the pirate gay bar. Gay bar. Cheers. Uh, they opened up new trade routes, which is how they got the X attack and armor, I suppose. Just checking in everywhere, being like, "Do you have a Do you have a crew? Do you have a crew? Do you have a crew? You got any crew based needs? Hey, do you have a crew? All right, I don't know if I've checked in with the Sailors Guild at the end of the last session. Hello. I'm pretty sure I'd already been here. I have. Cool, 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 cool. Oh, so yes, Mothman, the the drag, went down very well. I had a wonderful time. I exhausted myself into illness. Uh, I think is what happened. So that was wild. God, he's 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 quite attractive, isn't he? I love his fashion sense. I love yellow and purple in general. Let's just save. And then have a, a, a talk to Loose Cannon, whatever his name was. It'd be cool if I could beat one of these guys and then they join the crew. 
don't think that happens. But, you know, it's been a long time. Hey, is that one of those guys from the wanted list at the Sailor's Guild? Looking at punk. Hmm. Looks like we've got a live one here. At least it makes the bounty more interesting. I hear you've been thrashing up cities with that machine of yours. The name's Lappin, right? <laughs> what of it? And what? You here to try and stop me or something? Well, that that's the plan. My name's Vice, Vice of the Blue Rogues. We're here to earn a little cash. So, you're this vice that everyone keeps talking about. Make quite a name for yourself, huh? This day has turned out to be quite interesting. If I can defeat you, I'll become even more famous than you. Let's fight outside the city. I don't want anyone in not involved to get hurt. Cut to my ship and we'll fight there. Oh, no, that's Vice saying that. <laughs> Coward. But if fighting outside makes you feel more comfortable, whatever. Uh, you, you'll need all the help it can take to beat me. <coughs> I hear that you build that machine. I hear that you beat the built that machine yourself. Damn right I did. It's the only thing my good for nothing pops ever taught me. Dad? You have a dad? I think you must have hatched out from an egg or crawled out from under a rock somewhere. Watch your mouth. Besides, he's not even my real pops. He just found me somewhere and decided to raise me. I didn't ask for his help. He just picked me up and brought me home. Anyway, his name is Sentime, the coward. I figured it might be Sentime, the orphan adopter. Hey, Zorb! <gasps> Sentime's your dad? Huh, I doubt it. I don't see how Sentime could have raised a slime ball like this. I said, what's your mouth, wench? Wench? Wow, okay. You know a single thing about what you're talking about. Whoa, okay. So. That's uh, quite a machine you got there. Did you steal that from Shinra Corp? Me and Gunarm. The imagination involved. It's gotta be big. Real big! Not on that old fart of a dad. Vice, I'm gonna rip you apart with this machine. Best come out with your all, because I'm not holding back. <laughs> Hello, Zorb! We collected another crewmate. Someone we met before. Wench equals, equals please rip my dick off and choke me with it. Oh, yeah, it's not we'll get away from this and be nice friends language. Frock? The fuck is a frock? Well, I don't know what a frock is, but, you know. Hmm. Interesting. Okay. Hey, Candy. Oh, Enrique, he in the group now. Justice shield, Chris, defensive barrier for one turn that halves off physical damage. That's pretty cool. Counter strike. Oh, they're tiny lasers! That's pretty cool! Wow, they are all aiming for finer. Da boy! It's da boy! Oh, I didn't skip it. Okay. Ah! So they appear to be immune to magic, potentially, or just fire. Oh great, Justice! Moonstone Blast! Oh. Hey! Blocked! Counter? Can you counter? Okay. Ooh! Ready to unload some, uh...
some super healing shit. Unfortunately, I just bought some more. Sakuram crystals. And a blessing! Hell yeah! Moons, bless us! Oh, damn! Okay, rude. <laughs> Those things are fast, I might have to increase my quick to get ahead of them. <laughs> The rest of us are still in the game. Oh dear. Die. Fucking hell! Okay! These guys are hard! Okay! What was that? Looking on making a Google Forms thing to make a uh, Crusader Kings 3 character from. Cute. Cool. Now I need a res Yeah. Wait, who did I say, Matt? This is important. <laughs> okay, advice, you counter strike. Oh, rainbows. That implies to me something big is about to happen. You're gonna block. Or is it just make everyone attack Enrique? She's not blocking though, so we'll see what happens. Rampage! Oh, it's got a ram. Of course it is. Oh! Whilst blocking! So Vice is the only one with uh, Regen on anymore. Cool times, cool times. We gotta start buffing people. This is this is not going well. One down. And see how our community sees us and make a character from that. Oh, cool! That sounds cool. Increm. Let's 
doing a big one. I think it's targeting Enrique? I'm not sure. Incarim Enrique, so it's a better survival chance. Takes 12, Jesus. Let's up everybody's speed, because that's getting ridiculous. Everyone's health back up to max because the little ones have attacked us, and just a shield to decrease physical damage by half. What is doing stuff? Half! Oh, essentially it gives us all to block when we're not blocking. That's really cool. See if we can actually outspeed those stupid little bullet things. Rampage! That's not Enrique's direction at all! Oh god. She survived! That's a bonus! This is pretty good. That has sounded weird. We'll heal to max. You just block. Uh, no, that wasn't going to work. Oh well. Worth the try! The mod Princes of Darkness would be good for not requiring reproduction if you're okay with playing. A world of darkness vampire. Ah. Rules, give me strength. Yeah, again, so he he can be magicked, but the little fuckers can't. Yeah, that was a waste, unfortunately. Rules, give me strength. Is Webbles able to hit them all? Okay, it's not just elements, they appear to be straight at magic immune. Cool, 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 cool. Sidewinder? Well, that doesn't look good. Holy balls, this guy! And then there's this asshole. I think I might be dead, and then I'll have to... Come back at it later. Oh, poor Enrique. Yeah, he dead too. I haven't really done much damage to Loose Cannon Moon either. Much like with the fight with Rupee, I feel like I am punching above my weight somewhat. Target search. 
I, mean, I could just accept that he's going to kill one person. That appears to be what happens. I've used a lot of resources on this. Discussion of how safe people feel using Steam services. Makes sense. Lampa, okay. So much damage. Yeah, I'm pretty sure this one's a washout. But yeah, let's let's reload. Let's reload. Lover's Lab? Ooh. A lot of mods being Steam exclusive. Similar issues with RimWorld. Lover's Lab is clearly where I got the smutty ones, others on Nicholas. Oh, is Lover's Lab a place to get mods that are... sassy? I haven't done my eyebrows. Oops. But I have shaved and washed my face this morning. <laughs> Add sexy content to game mods are. Oh. Cool. I might have a look there for my own interests, for the sake of science. So, he's above my weight. Uh, I shall come back for you, loose cannon man. I am also going to look into the Angel of Death side quest, because I, I haven't had any interaction with her yet. Like, were there any instructions on the, uh, the piece of pepper that she gave me? Uh, the black spot. I'll await you west of Sailor's Island. Oh, I've just ignored her this entire time. Oopsie! Okay, so I'm definitely above her because uh, this first fight was meant to happen ages ago. I kind of misremembered it as she's saying she'll go find me. Fish! Is that the ship? Oh, purple! I think that's her. Yee! This is one of the best additions to the Legends game. You're the one that put out the black spot and called me out here. Yes, you're correct. You've been quite the popular air pirate around these parts lately, you know. However, I can't sit idly while air pirates fly the skies freely and do as they please. So cool! My name is Pierce still. I'm a bounty hunter, and I specialize in finishing off air pirates. I am feared among even the most hardened pirates. They have dubbed me the Angel of Death. And the angel has come for you, Vice! Wow, imagine that. We can famous enough to have some real bounty hunters come after us. Oh, grow up, Vice! It's not a good thing when bounty hunters come after you. Especially the ones called Angel of Death. You seem confident. Perhaps you truly are as strong as they say. I suppose this is why you've been able to stand toe-to-toe -to -toe with Valua. However, you are still just an air pirate. I'll send you and your mangy crew to the bottom of the clouds. She's cool. Wood cosplay. For a sexy thing.
Oh, she has a dog! Oh, I'm gonna have to kill the dog, aren't I? Death Hound! Cute. I know, right? None of us have mange. Well, honestly, I'm sure Gilda had a variety of STDs, but I don't think mange is one. Oh, you have a lot of health. Incremus. There's a multiple party member version of Incrum? I did not know that. That's cool. I knew one bit. His hair seemed fine, so no mange. Yeah, he's just, you know, kind of a douche. The clap? Sure. Oh, yeah. Riddled with these such things. God, I need to learn in Krimus. That would be great. Tempest Dance. Ooh. Holy balls! Okay, I was wrong. Maybe she fights you at the level you're at. I know she just had Incrim on her, so that definitely helped. Oh, poison! Bad dog! Woo! Cool. Counter-Strike! Second, the blessing. Block, 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 save your damn life. Attorney? Isn't that just death? The spell death? Of course she uses silver magic. You can heal! Well, I'm not happy about that. Not at all. Drillin and Quika. Cool that she throws knives like that. So in my GameCube playthrough, I never actually end I never got to the end of the Angel of Death plotline. When I originally played this game years ago. So I'm very excited to try and do that. Oh good, I was afraid it's gonna miss. She isn't damaged! I mean, by all means. Unless people have been countering her. Her hair is so punk! Ah, oh, The white fringe and the, the bluey purpley back. Oh, Lavender? Is she a lavender menace? Is Lady Gay? Is that what this is? Maybe she misunderstood she hunts down cis pirates. Cut fury. Hooray. And the dog fled and fainted like a Pokemon. It did. 
Cis pirates. Ew. Yeah, that's not what our flag means. Oh, damn. Right in the unarmed abdomen. Attorney. Stop trying to kill people! It's rude! 20 questions for the Google form. Ooh. Depthful. Alright, let's see if we can weaken her a little. Tempest Dance. Oh, it looks so cool. Ooh, still a lot. Ow! Countering as well. Rude. Drill. Miss. Got her. Silence. Can I stop her casting death? No, I can't. Great. Just block. Block is immediate. Luna wins. Ooh! I didn't know damage as well. A teeny bit of damage, but it removes Incrum! Hearts, 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 hearts. Thank you very much for the hearts. Um, yum, yum, yum. Sakuram! I could do with the learning the next level up. Webley. I don't want to tell you your job, Pierstol, or how to spell. But I, I'm pretty sure you meant to do that in a group of enemies, and then it'll hit multiple. <laughs> heart, rave, heart, rave. I'm cupel, rave. Queer cupels for you. Yeah, cupels in my pupils. Probably a fun highlight. Almost, we've got her on the ropes. Bonk. No oh, counter. We win. We did it. Oh, that's a good amount of money. That's a lot of that's a good amount of money. And we leveled. More max spirit. Hell yeah, all of that. How? How can this be? How can I lose to a lowly air pirate? I'm sorry, but I'm a tad too young to die just yet. Come back in maybe 50, 60 years. I might be already ready to keel over by then. In the meantime, we got to continue sailing. I think it's time for you to get back to your own ship. <sighs> that scar. 
the one on your cheek, and your goggle, singular. Huh? What are you mumbling about now? I can't be. No, I I recognize you anywhere. It is you. As I have told you, I am the angel of death, known across the skies. I swear upon that cursed name, I will haunt you. I will hunt you down and finish you off. I will find you again, and your deaths I shall bring. Until then, I will let you live. However, the next time we meet, it will be the end of you. Okay. Do you sell that lingerie? Do you... Yeah, we won one. Uh, where am I now on the map? Okay, so a good direction to go would be this way. Because if I go back to Sailor's Island... Oop. And there's something in the distance there. Oh, it's probably the lighthouse. That's a lot of enemies. But they're all looking the wrong way. Fire! Oh, Enrique. Do you think it would be Enrique or Enrique? The fish went straight through me. That's not what I wanted. I just wanted the fish to love me. Hello, little sailing boat. Where'd you get that ship? I haven't seen a fancy ship like that. That's a balloon ship! You stole it. You're either very brave or very stupid. Wait, what? We're fighting? Is it a balloon merchant that we're talking to? Oh, no, by sheer coincidence there was then a fight. Okay. I'm just defending to make it go faster. Oh yeah, I should have gone to Crescent Isle. Oh uh, yeah, I need to establish a base. And MVP goes to Ica for doing all of the work. Shrine Island. I don't think there'll be anything cool to know here, but I can have a look quick, see if there's anyone bumbling around. No. But it just gives me opportunity to save. So that's nice. Yeah, I forgot we need to get to Crescent Isle in order to rebrand this ship. There's kind of vortex at the bottom there. I thought I might be able to discover something. Oh, Lord. Yeah, let's go to Pirate Isle quickly, just because we're in the right area. I can't believe they called it Pirate Isle, and that's like... Well, no, they call it Sailor's Isle, but, you know. Woo! Oh, yeah, I wonder if they've rebuilt much. Because when we were last here, it had been burned and bombed pretty sufficiently. Hey, Vice, I heard you only managed to escape Valua, but you stole one of the rest ships as well. That's incredible. We've got a new ship, too. Just finished the last preparation for the Albatross, too. Working on it for a long time. It's the underground port. Finally finished. Can't wait to take her sailing. 
Can you believe it? That good for nothing husband of mine is so ungrateful. Do you know what he told me? I really feel at home when I'm out saving. Sailing, it's so relaxing. I have so much freedom. Oh, but I don't mean anything like that. Can you believe him? How would he not mean anything by that? I swear I should lock him inside the house from now on. And the next day, there was a murder. Hey, Vice. I just finished that scarf I was working on. What message you now, you ask? Tell you the truth. I'm having a baby! So I'm knitting clothes for the baby. Oh, I can't wait to see my baby wearing the clothes I'll make. I've definitely had a rich back historian narrative ever since you've been away and not been sat here making the same thing. Yeah, I told them I'd come back, so. Pow! Pow the dog! Oh! Okay, didn't think there'd be a cutscene. Uh, Vice, we wanted to ask you to do something for us. We really wish we could go help you out, but we're still too young, I guess. That's what our parents say. So instead, we want you to take Pow with you! He'll help you out instead! Burr, burr. Pow has always been there for us. Whenever we needed someone to cheer us up, he was there. And we were just thinking that maybe if Pow could go with you, he'd be able to cheer you up whenever we needed it, you know? Oh my god, I got a crew member! Well then, Pow looks like you're the newest member of my crew. You hear that, Pow? Vice is gonna take you with him. You're gonna sail in the big ship with his crew. Burr, burr, burr. Pow joined the crew as Jester of sorts. Yeah, I thought mascot, maybe. God. Hey, Vice, do you know there's six different colors of magic? Y yes. Oh, hi, Vice. How's Vice? Learn by experimenting firsthand, I suppose. Hey, Safi! How is it, goon? Yes, crabs and fish. Crabs everywhere, crabs everywhere. Oh, you're home. Did you want to rest for a little while? Yeah. I'll make a nice dinner for you. Yay! Good to check in on the fam. It is as yet not, uh, you know, brushed in any way, but I'm tempted to have a look and see how this looks on. Just to get an idea as to how big it is. Morning! Just be careful out there, okay? And make sure you bundle up if it gets cold. Just like builders, gilders bits. Crabs everywhere, crabs everywhere. It's very fair. Oh my god. Is there only one clip to go into the hair, or is there two? Oh, there is two, okay. And I was putting it on the right way. Okay, okay, okay. Oh my god, there's so much hair. Oh, and it smells really nice. I feel like they've done something with it. It's me, some kind of seaweed creature. There's so much hair, oh my god. This is lovely. It's got a kind of creamy smell. I can't see anything. It's always pride on this channel. Hello. <laughs> yes, become the tentacled one. 
Is that is that more hair or is that the the wig cap? Oh, it's no, it's got black roots. I see, I see. Good morning. You just be careful out there. Make sure you bundle up if it gets cold. This is so much hair. It's it's heavy. It's an impressive amount of hair. Now, is this the secret place, or is this how we get in and out? I can feel sound dampening. <laughs> oh, this was the secret place. We can have a good look at the Albatross 2! Looks a lot like the Albatross 1. We wish to it <laughs> wigs didn't itch so bad. Yeah, fair. So itchy. Yeah, they get really warm as well. This is already feeling quite insulative. <laughs> Oh, this is so funny. <laughs> I'm excited to to experiment with like teasing and treating. Okay, this is this is very this is very warm. Ah. Oh. oh my goodness. Oh well, the uh, the clips are working. They have decided to get up in my hair. Now, the website had a lot of lighting on its hair, and I thought this would match this. This honey blonde and this sea witch, I don't think are quite compatible. That's fine. I knocked over my my lovely long arm stapler. No, I love that thing. Okay, put it over there. okay. Uh, let's put this away. Whew! Everyone's saying that wigs get too hot. Have two wigs since before estrogen. I had a very male pattern baldness thing going on. Uh, hmm. I want to see where my day it is. Sorry, I know this is a sidetrack, but... Call me by your name And tell me you love me in private Wigs When will you wear wigs? Will you wear wigs? I'll do something like pirate shanty A little jiggity jig All the hugs. Yay! Hugs for all! Hey, Vice, if you're going on a voyage, make sure you equip your best weapons and armor. Well, yeah, obviously. It'd be weird if I didn't do that. Oh, there's really nothing up there. Okay. New ships always look so much nicer. What a big jaw he has. Ah, he's been causing plenty of trouble for the Blue Empire. Gotta get him back for what they did to us, yes sir. We don't have that anymore, and we decided rather quickly after getting our second wig to go with hats instead. Oh, hats are cool. Vice the Valiant has a nice ring to it. Oh, you don't update your stock. Okay. Thanks for stopping by. Okay, we got stuck there. Everyone's called me Vice the Valiant now. It's so cool. What will my dad call me? Pirate father! Father! Pirate father! We must have a pirate meeting, pirate father. 
For pirate reasons, father. Father pirate. And then I'll go to Crescent Isle and actually do some plotline. I promise I won't oversleep this time. Just let me sleep a little, okay? Oh, I love his sleeves. Hey, you pirate dad, how's it going? No, it's not vice, this time when something more important than brute strength or sharpness of mind defines, defines a man. Learn to be a swashbuckler. Okay. I thought we were going to have, like, a catch-up and you'd, like, congratulate me for stealing a ship, maybe. But alright. Unsure if hats have gendered social results uh, or rules in other countries. Uh, but they do here. But especially if you're going to going against the expected there, that felt good. Oh. Hats need just as much care too. Oh god, yeah, I need to clean one of my hats. Steam them, shape them, make sure they don't crumble or bend over. Oh yeah, because the bend never comes out. Mm -mm -mm -mm. Yeah, I have a really nice witch hat with a, a large brim. I love it. I haven't been up here. And then I will leave. I'm feeling better today. I think that if I eat something good before I head to work, then I should be able to, to, to head to work. Savvy says, hate hats as much as wigs, but that's just me. Keep a sharp lookout. You have no death perception. I've got a wife to protect. Okay. I believe you, man. So obsessed with a bowler hat, sir. Uh, one fedora. But the bowler hat is our go-to now. Ah, bowler. Classy. For a classy gentle them. There's a lot of, uh... There's a lot of stairs. Must be said. Alright. To the skies! Oh yeah, what does uh, Pow do? Using crew command, you will raise your chance of attacking first for a full turn. Ooh. Cool. Every time I hear about a bowler hat, I think of an old song. Oh. Is it, um... Digging a hole? Uh... Death perception is not the sole function of having two eyes. This is very true. Can I go through this? No, I remember correctly, I can't, that's fine. Okay. Let us leave! Via potential discoveries. Oh, I think I've gone the wrong way. I have, no, I have to go. Hole in the ground, burn a cribbage, that's the one. There was I, digging it deep. It was round at the bottom and the sides were steep. Along came a bloke in a bowler, which he lifted and scratched his head. He looked down at me, at me in me old, and he said... Yeah. Especially having long distance, having two eyes is less important. Yeah, that's true. Actually, yeah, I suppose the depth perception is less of a thing at long distances than just seeing literally at all. Woo! Noxus. Hello, fish. Yes. No. Go round this wall. Good lord. I'm sidetracked enough as it is. But I did get pow, so that's cool.
these fights. They are too weak. Oh, they can be damaged by magic. You just need very powerful. Cool. I mean, is long is long distance the death perception game for having two eyes is much less. Oh. Where's the wall? There it is. Fire! Right, that's where we were. Okay. Maramba, Nusrad, Crescent Isle. Oh, so I can go th via Nusrad, which is cool, because I'm pretty sure that I have some folks there that I can recruit from the ruins of Nusrad. Oh, hello. I've got like one. <laughs> what I'm really hoping is that I get someone who can do something with all these fish that I'm getting. Some of this blue, I kind of want to swap to red, see if we can get ink from ink from number two. A little pebble rock? Is that, is that got anything on it? Oh, I can't go down that far. Okay. Still try to catch undersea fish. Not that side. Belly up. Yes, yes it was. Wonderful. Moving on. The Temple of Trinvin. Maramba. And Srad. Can I stop by Maramba? I don't know if there's anyone recruitable at Maramba. <gasps> the Fortune Teller! Maybe. I'm trying to think of people who have unique avatars. Some of the people you recruit I remember, some of them I don't. Blib! Death, 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 blood, blood, death. He's so gay! I love him! Please let him be gay. When will he wear wigs? This isn't Maramba.
Oh, uh, it's through the rock field that I can't get there yet. That's fine. All right, uh, Nusrat. Yeah, this way and a little left. Through this alleyway. This sky rock alleyway. So many times. Revered voice. Every now and then I catch myself in the camera and I'm like, wow, I really have no eyebrows. <laughs> I don't know, it's funny to me. Nearly at blue for Henri. The destroyed capital of Nusrad, everybody! Put your cameras away. Let's see. The box of tomatoes, one, two. Those boxes look any good either. When there are only this many survive the fire, you cannot miscount even if you want to. Say because we did a lot of flying. I came intending to buy replenish my supplies in this rad. The place is burnt to the ground. A shock. There was nothing being sold in the shops. What's available is so expensive. I have to replenish my supplies somehow. Stop. They're still so good at their job. There's... The cannoneer above here was very cavalier. That wasn't intentional. That just kind of happened. Oh, there we go. I thought he was too happy looking. Ah, oh, crap! Damn it all! They called me the best gun around. I was Kazim! The crack shot! But I let down my guard. Before I could do anything to stop them, the enemy turned the whole city into dust! It really chaps my hide. I think I will fly right to Baloo and give him the blast in the chops. Okay, calm down, calm down. You do anything like that, you'll get blasted right back. It's way too reckless. So does the man who's so reckless to escape from Blue twice over. What? What? You're not. Oh, say it. Say my name. Could you be that pirate Vice, the Valiant, who abducted the Blue and Prince and blasted his way out of the Grand Fortress? Well, I, I don't know about abducted parts, but otherwise, yes, I'm indeed Vice. And I'm Enrique! In that case, you've got to do this for me. Vice, let me join your crew. What a hunky man. I will never be satisfied until I deliver a blow from my cannon to Valua. I must join forces with you. Become your ship's gunner. Good, it is decided. Uh, well, it doesn't like you'll sound sounds like you're taking no for an answer, so, um, sure. May as well have you on board. Because he must join your crew as gunner. Woo! In fairness, that gun looks a bit fucked, so... What else was he going to do? Oh, I wonder if we can raid the remains of the palace. There might be nice things in it. Like, normally I wouldn't, you know, raid a bomb site, but that kid, that, uh, Nasultan was a bit of a dickbag. Wait, did his entourage come with us? Hmm. Cool. Oh, 
Oh, the picture's changed. It's now a sad scene. Oh, I never expected that the Nasaurian force was collapsed so easily before the Luan attack. I wouldn't have dreamed they'd be able to get through the strait. Oh boy, was Kazim mad. He never got to get a single shot off. Oh, Poor boy. There! There's another very unique avatar. Oh, hello. Okay, but... Vice, I'm not interested in the water! Cham! A massive bobbing raid turned the bazaar into a heap of rubble. It had to be closed because it was too dangerous. Well, since my house was burned down and all my valuables were confiscated, I wouldn't be able to afford anything anyway. With that money or a place to play, the only thing left for us to do is sit here and whisper sweet nothings into each other's ears by the fountain. Aww, that's kind of sweet. You! Man who refused to give loans! Oh, my shop! My shop is gone! It is too much to bear. Take a jam, take a jam, take a jam, take a jam, jam. My shop is nothing more than a heap of rubble. And my clerk ran off with all the money. I am completely ruined! I feel kind of sorry for her. Huh? Oh. I'm sorry. You know, Vice, we could take it with us on our ship. Ship? You own a ship? How big is it? How much cargo can it hold? How much money do you make in transporting goods? That cat, clegging on for dear life. <laughs> I may not look like much, but you seem to be doing... You may not look like much. Sorry. But you seem to be doing well for yourself. Okay, I've decided. I will go with you on your ship. Sounds like I could make some money. Well, on, you can't just decide that all by yourself. I'm an excellent trader. I can help you find treasures that would normally be almost impossible to find. But I seem to recall someone saying they couldn't give us even one gold without collateral, just because they, would, because they weren't running a charity. I... I, under, I apo understand. And I apologize for sending you away cold-heartedly before. I'll make you so much money that anything I would have loaned before would seem like moon dust. Osman has joined your crew as a merchant. Hmm. A little reluctant to let the, the hyper-capitalist on board, but whatever. Uh, oh, oh, no, can we get to the palace? Aw, uh, I thought it might be a cham or something out front. Take a jam, take a jam, take a jam, take a jam, jam. Moonwalk your greedy ass away and we'll keep your pink cat. Oh, totally. See if the cat and the dog get on. That'd be nice. It's a pretty shop. No moonfish. Is it Vice the Daring? Oh, is it not? Thank you for visiting my shop. It's an honor to have you. Buy and sell items. May as well help the local economy. The Sultan of the Soldiers were taken away to Valua. Civilians are the only ones left. Under the red moon, the kingdom of Lassar was such a place of glory and splendor. It is astonishing to see how fragile it all was. I'm wondering if I can find my old friend, the the old merchant, who uh, gave us his passport. If he's alive, it might be nice to give him safe harbor.
I've heard of you, Vice the Daring. I wish I had a title like that. Nah, you didn't upgrade the update any of your stock either. May the red moon shine on you. Come again. I guess there's one place... Well, there's the inn left to check. And also... The bar! Where the gals were employed temporarily. Oh, they've been saying that the Sultan and his family were executed. So depressed. They say they were all dragged off to Valua, executed in front of a huge crowd. That sounds like a thing they would do. That's horrible. Man, I cannot believe it. How could this rat have been reduced to this? The people used to come here to have either died or left town. There's almost no one left. Perhaps there's nothing left to do but close up shop. Oh, we're not going to offer him a position? Okay. I mean, he was a bit sexist, but, you know, not as much as Gilder, and we rode with that guy. Oh. Hello. Vice the Daring. Oh. Is that the legendary Dakats coin? How'd you find it? I will pay you 20,000 gold for it. Hmm. Gotta quickly look up if that's uh, a thing I want to do. Skies of Arcadia. The cat's coin from the man who can see directly into our inventory. The coin itself can be sold for 20,000 gold, yep, after you return from the Grand Fortress. It's very helpful when 100,000 gold is needed to pay Zimu and Thimu to continue the story. Oh, yes! Because, yeah, we need to... We need capital to build a base. Oh, another black spot. A message from the Angel of Death. Sounds like you're in trouble. Another message from the Angel of Death. Well, no one died last time. She was hard, but no one died, so we'll be up to doing it again. Where does she want to meet now? Red ink, jet black paper. I await you at the place we fought. Pissed. Cool. Well, I didn't know where I thought I'd go from there, but... Uh, I didn't know if we'd be able to see our old... Our old trader friend. Around here. But, uh... If I can't find him, then I assume that he... Let's assume that he got out of town. to both rooms now. Man, hotels, eh? Everything looks the same. Oh. It's a terrible mess all around, but the inn has survived. Would you like a night? A room for the night? Yes. To be frank, I have so much money, and as a blue rogue, the money should be redistributed. So I feel like maybe I should be giving them more. <laughs> Good luck, Chakra. I couldn't really see that corner. I thought it was worth having to investigate. 
Oh, I hope the nice old man got away. I'm gonna need to go pee in the left a little bit. Maybe once I get back on the boat. Take a jam, take a jam, take a jam, take a jam, jam. I would like a jam. Hey, debris, you got any debris hunt jam? Well, it's easy to find our own boat. It's the only one that's made of metal. Ooh, let's have a little look, see at who we got. Crew. Gunner, Kazim. Having Kazim in your active crew will increase the damage done by main cannons. Woo! Osman, merchant, dickbag. Having Osman in your active crew will increase your chance of finding expensive items. Ooh, okay, that's pretty cool. It's the big fancy one. I mean our little dinghy that we use to go out to places. Wow. Pinta. Oh, we're stocking them up. Very excited. So the next place to go is Crescent Isle. Yeah, I'm not going to get anything out of any of the others around here. There's still so much unexplored map. This, this game is wonderful. Alright, I'm going to go pee real quick. And then I'll be right back. Oh! I'm back. All right. North to Crescent Isle. Going up, 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 up. Might be some more decent fights in here now. Or maybe not. You're dead, you're dead. You're dead and out of this world. Ow. Oh, silence too. It's a shame we don't need music to to die. So close to the blue. Hello. I think I already got you, but... Yeah, I did, I did. Cool, cool. No! To Crescent Isle! Almost! Oh, so these ones are a bit spookier. Run, it just started, and you have no legs! Oh. Not quite what I was hoping for. Bonk! Oh. This is, uh, not going quite how I might have liked it to. Why are you all running? Am I that intimidating? Just don't get into the fight in the first place!
Do you all mind either, either getting away or not bothering? This is a little bit time consuming. Fall down. Oh my god, someone please hit. Luna Glyph. No damage, no stone. Oh, there we go. Finally a hit. Magic question mark? Nothing. These guys are more confusing and time wasting than anything. <laughs> Crumb. Oh, come on! You're barely even doing anything and you want to heal? Got one at last. Come on, Viner. Vice the daring. Also, is Vice the accurate? Red, blue, green, green. Yeah, that's fine. Crescent Isle, Crescent Isle. Oh, Crescent Isle. Oh, nice music. Vice, this is pretty amazing, huh? Hey, hey Enrique, how does it feel to be outside the Imperial Palace? Uh, oh. Oh. Everything is so beautiful. I've never seen anything like it before. Ah, uh, looks like someone's a little airsick. Perhaps all this travelling is a little rough for your shelter for our sheltered prince. Yes, I can. Um, you are correct. I, I never realised that sailing could be so rough. This is my decision. I can't let a little airsickness slow me down. <gasps> Enrique, are you going to be all right? Well, it looks like this is going to be a long trip for Henry K. Yeah, don't worry, dude. Once you get used to the sailing, you'll get sick as easy. I'm sure you'll be okay. Gangly old man's voice. Alright, good instruction. Hey! It took you guys long enough to get here! Small old man. <laughs> Wait, gangly like body? Was I meant to make his voice gangly? Okay. Hey, hey! It's nice to meet you! You're Vice, right? Gilder told us that you needed a crew, and we're here to report for duty! <laughs> I'm Brabham! If anything's broke, I can fix it! I'm the greatest engineer that ever lived! Yep, still alive! There's a nice looking ship! If you want, I can get it running smoother than ever! Crack it up a few notches. Give him a power. <laughs> what was that noise meant to be? Ba ba bam. Hey, Meal. You want something built? I'ma build it. You don't want something built? I'ma build it anyway. I'm build some buildings for you. You're gonna need a base, right? Uh, sure. Thank you. 
Leave it up to us! But before we get started, we'll need some funds to cover the expenses and labor. We're not con men! First, I'll fortify the hull of your ship so you can pass through those stony reefs. Then I'll upgrade your engine so you'll be able to power it through the sky rift for no time. But it will cost you... That was a big pull. 25,000 gold! I plan to fill your port and some living quarters first. Let's see, cha-ching, I need about 75k. What a bargain! So, a uh, hundred thousand gold? Well, the Delphinius... Whoa, the, Delphi the Delphinius does need some modifications. We're gonna need more than a couple of caves to call this a base. Enrique's right. I am. So let's put off our search for the other moon crystal until we get a hundred thousand gold to pay these um men. Great news! I have that already. I'm rich. I'm rich, baby. I'm gonna be less rich. This is two thirds of my money, but you know. I need seventy-five thousand gold to start building your headquarters. You gave him seventy-five thousand gold. Hmm. Don't worry. This will be the best investment of your life. I wish this base wasn't so secret. I want everybody to want to see how great it's going to be. So, do you have 25,000 gold? Yeah, happy face. Slightly creepy. Happy face. Yeah. Give me the money. Bless your heart. To be! I can find a find a heart and you'll feed us for you. You'll be going to a stone reef to sky ships in no time. This will probably take all night. But don't worry! Make sure the ship's ready to go by tomorrow morning. Counting on you, Brabham. Now I'll be able to go after the rest of the moon crystals. What a wonderful detour we didn't take. Oh, I just remembered. We're talking about making a new flag, right? If everyone's finished, we can decide on one. Oh, I'd forgotten all about that. All right, Vice, you first. What? Me first? Well, I, I put a lot of thought into this, and don't laugh, people. This is what I drew. You drew that? Being air pirates and all, I figured we should have a, at least a skull on the flag. And since most pirates use swords, I figured we could have one of those on the flag, too. That's pretty good. Alright, Ica, you're next. I figured the skull thing was overdone, so I tried to go with something quick and cunning. That's why I drew a cat. Ah! Okay, everyone. I might do a chat vote on what flag to keep. I drew some gold to show people that we'd sneak upon them and steal their gold before they knew what happened. That... <laughs> that cat looks just like you. Well, I had to give the cat some personality. I think I got a little carried away. Merp! Way too carried away. Alright, Fina, your turn. Well, I felt the skulls were a little too scary, so I wanted to make something happier. Ah! The world Delphinus comes from an ancient creature who used to live in the seas. I drew one of them on to show the, what the ship was named after. There's no reason to be embarrassed. I don't think there's ever been an air pirate flag that looked like this. I like it. Well, that's all of them. Vice, you're the captain. Which one do you like? Uh -huh. Oh, they all look really good. I think the default is to go for Vice, but if I actually get a choice... Pull, 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 pull. People like the cat. I also like the cat. I'm, I'm, I'm not against having the cat. How do I, how do I pull? How do I pull? Give me a minute. Um, not there, not there. Is that a poll? Manage poll. There we go. Create poll. Which flag? Vice's skull. Ike's kitty. Find this dolphin. Is 
Start hole. I have begun the poll! Should be there at the top of the chat box. It's open for one minute. The cats a lot. And they are blue pirates, so I like finest. That's fair. Zorb is definitely team cat. Much as I love cats. Safi, you still about? We fall into the hole in the ground by Bernard Cribbins. I also decided to allow additional voting if you use bees, just to see what happens. Bees, 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 Thank you all very much, because Zorb spent more than I did, lol. Bees! Missed the poll. Oh, sorry, Safi. Which one would you have gone for? The cat, uh, the dolphin, or the one that no one cares about? <laughs> I was doing my makeup. Ooh, doing your makeup. You going out anywhere nice? Doing a thing? I'm just having some fun. Cat. Well, sorry, uh, uh, Candace. With and without the additional voting power of bees, I believe it's the cat. Meow. I think Ica's fl flag will lift the spirits of the crew. Just like looking pretty behind the bar. Oh yes, that thing. Cool. I agree. I like what it stands for, and it's pretty funny. Thanks. I'm glad you like it. I'll make a big one and put it on the bridge. Oh, it's getting late. I'm starting to get hungry, too. <laughs> hey, everyone! Dinner's ready! Yay! Great timing! Well, looks like we're spending the night on new headquarters. Crescent Isle! The skull did look pretty nice, just not good enough. Yeah. I'll post selfie and good stuff to boost ego. Go for it! Love a bit of that. You've seen a video of me basically dancing naked, so... Well, the improvements to our ship are almost finished, and pretty soon we'll have an actual base on this island. Yeah, starting tomorrow we should start searching for the remaining moon crystals. Yes, and I hope this time I won't get airsick. <laughs> You'll have to get over that. Oh, Fina, there's something I wanted to ask you. Your butt was very nice. My butt was so in the camera shot, it was hilarious. That Admiral, um, Ramirez, how do you know him? What? When you met him in Nisrad, you seem to know an awful lot about him. If you don't feel like telling me, it's okay. Don't worry about it. You were wearing underwear, mostly. <laughs> I mean, all of you looked very nice gay self nearly die. <laughs> all of you looked very nice gay self nearly died. <laughs> ah, to be fair. Yeah, it was, it was wonderful. I loved it. No, I'm sorry. I should have told you all about him sooner. I will tell you everything I know about... Ramirez. You know that I am a Sylvite, a descendant of the Silver Civilization. Ramirez is a Sylvite as well. What?! Well, he had silver hair. Figure it out. Ramirez was our best warrior. He can channel the power of the Silver Moon through his blade, making it sharp enough to cut through light. We grew up together. A long time ago, he was one of my best friends. He didn't used to be so... so heartless and cruel. He used to care for me like a little sister. When we heard the balloons were trying to reawaken the Gigas, Ramirez volunteered to come down and try to stop them. He went on a journey to search for the crystals. Alone. Shortly after he started his quest, we lost track of him. We never even dreamed that he would join forces with the Blue and Empire. Those are the people that he was sent here to stop. I 
I don't know why he changed. I hope that Ramirez... I hope that the Ramirez I knew isn't gone forever. Admiral... Admiral Ramirez is... Not only is he one of Valua's greatest swordsmen, he's also a master strategist. He used to be Galician's vice-captain, but I don't think even Galician knows of Ramirez's past. Finer. And still with confidence, I'll try and cheer her up. Finer. I'm sure we'll find out what happened to Ramirez. What's important now is to keep pushing forward. Don't ever forget that. Nice. Don't give up, Finer. You aren't alone. We're here with you now. Yeah, Finer. You're, you're one of our friends now. I've only known you for a short while, but if anyone did anything to Finer, I would kill everyone in this room and then myself. I mean, I can too consider you my friend. Ica. Vice. Third character. When I came here, I was all alone. Now I've found so many wonderful friends. Thank you so much. Aw, thank you all. Thank you all. I will do my best. Alright. Tomorrow we continue our search for the rest of the moon crystals. We can start early. Oh, Enrique, are you sure you can get up on time without a servant to wake you? Hey, I always get up on my own. I don't need any servants. It's time. Fine, where should we head next? In the east, there's a land that basks in the light of the blue moon. That land is known as Yafutoma. Cough. Gets up on his own, doesn't need service. They harness the powers of the blue moon and have control over wind and water. Their culture is very different to yours. Yafutoma, Yafutoma. You've heard of it, Enrique? Yes, according to Valuan historians, Yafutoma is a country far east of Nassar, scattered across several small islands. It's Asian themed! I remember the stories. The people there are protected by scales, and they eat, and they eat by manipulating two sticks to pick up their food. Huh? They eat with sticks? They're protected by scales? Oh, great, another drawing from Ika's imagination. How are you supposed to eat with two sticks? What do you mean, scales? Are they monsters? No, they're gonna eat cupel. Somehow, I don't think that's what they're, it's what you're imagining, Aika. I wonder what these strange wind and water people look like. I still can't imagine eating with two sticks. I was hoping we could eat all kinds of exotic food on our trip. Now I'm worried. I mean, in fairness, my empire is very racist. It's probably quite wrong. To get through to Yafutoma, we should continue to sail around the southern tip of Nassar. Some time ago, during the Valuan Nassar War, a cape was discovered by uh, Valuan forces invading south of Nassar. That cape was named Cape Victory. The city there is called Esperanza. If anyone knows how to get to Yafutoma, it will be the people there. Alright, south of Nassar. Everyone get to your stations, let's go. Kitty! Oh yeah, they do change the, the, the main color of the ship to blue after that. It was purple before, and I liked the purple, but it's fine. They changed it to blue for consistency. Hey, Captain Vess, how's the Davinas doing? That's a mighty fine looking ship if you ask me. Ah. Building a base is gonna take a while. I need to start with the foundation and work my way up. It's worth the wait. If you've been after them moon crystals, now it is a good time. I should have a base up by the time you get back. Oh, I wanted to have a base now. I like bases.
Look at this fishless pond. Look at it! Disgrace. All about that base, all about that base, yeah. To bridge! I haven't actually looked around the boat before. Uh, hey! You can get to see some of our crew members doing stuff. Bow! Bow, bow! Oh, cute dog. This is great, have ice. We can finally make it into Sky Rifts. Can't believe it. There's so much to see out there. The city of Esperanza. We should head there first. Oh, good. This is where I can check what I should be doing with myself. Kitty! Yes! Very happy with that. <coughs> I thought I might be able to put that ready pink branding on the ship as well, but it doesn't seem to have happened. If I get on the on the outside, on the deck, there we go. Can I or would there be fish? Ah, hello Osman. All kinds of expensive goods get across the table. Where does Osman find all this stuff? Isn't Esperenza, a town full of poor people, in southern trip into Sar? I think I'll stay on the ship. God, you're a dick. Oh, I've been hearing that Esperanza is populated by ex Valoon soldiers, and soldiers have lost their ships in the Dark Rift. Maybe my husband is there, my Reginald, my man. Today's specials are mid-ocean style sauteed fish and the spice of the sky. I see him in my dreams, I do, that man of mine. I can't share those dreams with you, Captain. They're far too raunch for Twitch. Oh. I just enjoy voicing Polly. <laughs> Sorry, y'all. Ooh, the deck. Fish, 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 fish. Ooh! Wow, he did come with his own help. Ah, look at his deck. Now about if I say so myself. I've been working really hard. Oh my god, there's so many guns. Um. Um. It just looks a little suspect. Oh, don't worry, Captain. I'll make sure the cannons are always ready to go. Polishing the... Yeah, it's the... It's the angle as well. This one... Oh, no, it's a little... Okay. Leave the Delphinus cannons to us, sir. All right, men. Make sure you load those cannons properly. I want those uh, things ready to kick some Valuans' butt at a moment's notice. Yes, sir. Right away, sir. So these three are in a uh, kind of kink work polycule relationship, right? Because because they are. Look at them. Oh, Esperanza. <sighs> Can't believe we have to go to the southern tip of Nassar. It's an awfully far. I knew this wasn't going to be easy. I suppose saving the world ever is. Whoa. Oh, God. Yeah, I'm impressed Marco's kept the deck so clean with, um... With poor Enrique, uh, spilling his guts to the ocean. The boy. My poor boy. My poor the boy. Alas, I didn't get any things about, uh, Moonfish. Ah, ah, itchy back, itchy back, itchy back, itchy back! Ah, there we go. Yeah, sus, sus polishing job, for sure. Well, I can't even use my mono monocle up here. Monocular? Everything's shiny, Captain! Uh, 
actually shiny. It's metal. It's true. I want so these floors so clean I can eat half of them. I don't want the gravity so intense they won't be swept by the w away by the wind. Fancy door to the bridge. Captain on the bridge! Do you want to take the wheel now? Alright. Oh, there's Pinta! Uh, oh well, I'll talk to him another time. Hooray! We have a crew. We have a ship. We have places to be and people to do. I don't know. Okay, so I should be able to go to the Sky Rifts again now. Uh, so... Ixus. There are people in Ixataka and Moramba that I might try to recruit. I just want to get the crew together because you get lots of bonuses from having crew people. I won't. Is that the Tablet of Ages again? Yeah, it is. Oh. Oh great, it's them fuckos. Miss! How? It's It was surprised. It wasn't even looking at me. It also doesn't have any eyes. Oh, there we go. Thank you, Helmeppo. No, Helmeppo. Why do I always want to call him Helmeppo? Enrique. 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 Bonk. Cut us here. Yes. Bonk. Run. With what? Legs! You floating venom gnat. Yeah. So that's the that's the capital. So I actually want to go to Maramba. Oh, which can be accessed by going this way, maybe? Yeah, it looks like it could be. Secret green area. I'm pretty sure I've been there here before and discovered something. Some kind of weird sky snake. Looking forward to being able to go up there at some point after some more ship upgrades. This place is dead end. Great. It's just a lot of the same fight. That's my issue. It's very repetitive. Hi, that it works the normal way. Well, mostly. Fab! things. It run. It don't know how run. It, it wobble. Yeah. 
so fabulous. Right. Just follow this round, see if I can get to Maramba. So it's not exactly the same fight this time, that's nice. Call allies! Oh, balls. Ugh. All they want to do is run away. Maybe it's based on my level. Summon allies only to run away. Come on. Oh, there we go. Oh, there we go. All right, through the straight. Oh good, we can go through those now. Okay, great. What's that? Oh, it's a boat. It's a black pirate ship! Ooh. Oh, go on, I've not done any pirate... I've not done any boat fights today. Oh, I swear to God. Stepped down the enemy level, I think. Bonk. You've been bonked! Let's fight! I want to see about these crew commands. Ooh, this one's on our turf. Do you can play play around these parts without paying the price? Crew! Ooh. Polly, replenish one character's MP. Uh, Marco, double spirit points for one turn. Wowza. Pow! Raise your chance of attacking first for a full turn. That's really cool. Some moonsun cannon. 
Very cool, very cool, very cool. Alright. Let's see how we do. Big, beautiful new ship. Oh, missed. That's unfortunate. Black Torpedo! Oh, God! Right. That dealt a lot of damage. I think we fucked them. No. that black torpedo going to come down, I wonder? We have so much health. Did we come back, come back to lap torpedo? Did we just come back to lap torpedo? I... Wow. Hey, maybe. Oh, black torpedo. It was called... A, they painted it black because they're black pirates. And they're... Lap torpedo size queen. I'm pretty sure they'll be dead by then. Polly! That's cool. Big old pink sparkles. Black torpedo! Kaboo. Yeah, I figured they'd be, uh... Wow. Wow, we have... We've gotten better. What? Us? Never. <laughs> well, that was cool. Now, Maramba should be on the west. There we go. <laughs> bees, 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 Blessed be. Z. Welcome back to Maramba. It has been a long time. Virus the Daring. I don't think I've discovered anything new. No, I've just been trapped in the same areas. Oh, hidden stash. Blocked off by stone reefs and sky rifts. Passing the South Ocean to see something about a predator. Ooh. Somewhere in Valua, towards the west. Valua's a big place, but I hear it's somewhere around there. Straight, sir. There's only one place like that. It's a well-known rough spot, though. Cool, okay. So, my thought is the fortune teller has a pretty unique uh, avatar. I'm wondering if maybe she can join the crew. She might not. There might be no one here that can, but... What about you? You're pretty unique, aren't you, darling? Yes, you will. Oh, the guy here who bangs his head on the table. He's pretty unique. There's kind of a muster guy doing squats on a rooftop somewhere. We already have Kazim, who's a muscly guy who I'm sure does squats. With his mates. Hmm. Hmm. Footsteps leading out of here. That's weird. Oh, handsome man. Hello. I feel like maybe there's like a men to watch out for hotties edition that goes around or something like Here are the wanted people you should avoid Here are the people who are doing really cool shit that you should maybe not avoid and say hi if you see them 
Are these my footprints? No, they're not. Okay, they're just footprints. Yeah, that guy going up and down like a like a going up and down guy. Can't even move around here. Oh yes, a girl went to elope. I remember that. I remember that one. Bang head man. Hello. Do you want to join a crew? I said, Daring, you're so famous. Heard of something from me? So that was the war. Okay, I'm gonna leave. No, don't. I just wanted to be friends, dude. Please stop injuring yourself. Ride the shoe puff. Whatever noise it makes. You! You there! Yes, you! Village Elder. I understand that Lazar's capital, Nasrad, was destroyed by Valuans. Stay a moment. Listen to what I have to tell you. Never tell you about how I fought in the Nasrad forces against Valua. I remember the Valuan fleet had this admiral. Though he was relatively young, he was sharp as Dahabu's teeth. Bold, but cautious. While mounting a frontal assault or a surprise attack, he was a master of strategy. I think his name was Galician. I understand he now condemns the entire armada. With a man like that in command of an armada. No surprise that the capital fell so easily. Wait, make an excuse and hurry on. That's the problem with young people today. Well, yeah, he's not joining. He's just just a guy doing squats, doing his thing. There's no people in this one. It's just like a storage house, which is wild. Wrong way. The harbor. You! Welcome. Mm -hmm. You! I have seen your face in my dreams. It was a dream when someone was holding a Saurian blade. Beckons me into the sky. Perhaps it was nothing. Do you wish to know of your fate? I have my fortune told. Mm -hmm. Bang, bang. Ah! The Red Moon has spoken. Amidst the dark winds lives a man. Stranded for many years. Go forth and seek your fate. Saurian blade. Do I have one of those? No. Uh, does Ori? No. Okay. Come back here with the Surian blade. I'm gonna make a note of that. Find one of those and come back here. Have we got any new dancing girls in here? Nope. If you're looking for Belena, she quit. Yeah, a long time ago, my dude. Get over it. Okay, so I think there is a recruit here. But I have a quest to fulfill to get them. A condition to fulfill. Man with a Saurian blade from my dreams. Oh well, it was good to look at while we're in the Nasrad area. And next, Ixataka. I will do the plot, but I also have been very much looking forward to the gathering the crew aspect, so. Yeah, that's what's going on there now. 
knows what's going on. Nothing's fine, I'm told. I'm all out of faith. Back to the sky. <sighs> right. I might be able to go straight to Horteca from here now. Sail straight west. As straight as is possible for a crew this gay. Oh, there's Doc. I don't believe I have any more Moonfish, though. Oh, yeah, there is another fight with uh, Piast still waiting for me. Got to bear that in mind. gonna be even harder next time though. Yeah. Very dead. Very, very dead. Very, very dead. Very, 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 very dead. No, skips. I missed the skip. Pretty warm. Pretty warm. Need to eat food. Oh. Hey. This isn't there. Oh, this is the, the passage. Right, I see. Yay! Special fish. The green moon. Which way do I want to enter this? Aha! Ixataka. The wrong side of Horteca. Let me touch the fuck down. Oh my god, let me in! Thank you. Jeez. Welcome, welcome. Oh yeah, so the Sentimes crew is off this way. There is Hans, the, the hot mechanic boy, so maybe he can be recruited. I feel like he is a recruiter, a recruiter, a recruiter, -er. I feel like Han be a recruiter, -er. Tiny children playing around. Well, hello there, Mr. Vice. Long time no see. 
Oh, Mr. Vice, hello! You're a captain now, aren't you, Mr. Vice? Congratulations! Right now I'm working as a factory technician. Well, my stint is over. Uh, that is... I wonder if you'd be willing to take me on as part of your crew. I'd like to be on your ship's... I'd like to be your ship's engineer. Yes! I can be your engineer? Thank you very much. I'm so excited to be working with you. Well, my stint as factory technician is over. Hmm. I'm gonna guess... If it isn't time related, and it would be kind of weird for it to be time related, I'm gonna guess I need to get uh, loose cannon Lappen uh, dealt with. Then he'll return here and take Hans's place. I would imagine. So, I can get him on at a later date. Don't currently have an engineer, I don't think, so that would be good. Call me when you want, call me when you need, call me, I'll drop everything. Hello. So I believe there's two more people I'm thinking of that can be recruited here. Uh, there's the guy who was the lookout with the greatest eyes, so he says. Nope. And there was the dancing girl who's currently not dancing. But apparently it is not this way. Well, me when you won't. I think that way ends up with going down the slide. That will. No, the slide will take a while, and it will go in a direction. I think I should go this way first, to where the village chief is. Or the elder, elder. The village chief is in his other place. Unless he's moved back here now. Oh, my son is alive and well and with me again. I feel so happy every day. Ah, your vice. Thanks to you that my life was saved. I was forced to work at Moonstone Mountain. Now I can go take care of my mother. Thank you. Her her sad cry and happy cry have the same animation, which is very fun. The deepest gratitude. Yeah, I can rest. Why not? Dancing! Music! Very hungry. I will go to make food. Soon. You have a nice ship. You've flown a lot. Do you know this area well? Have you seen a ship with all women sailors around here? Sometimes I see them flying nearby. They are definitely different from the women here. Even with my eyes, I cannot always see where they go. I'm very curious about them. Place with just women, hmm? Sorry, can't help you there. Too bad. I won't leave here until I find out. That's what, that's your condition, is find a place with just women? I kind of want to leave you there. Also took a selfie when getting food. Can put it in good stuff there as well. Yeah, go for it.
Is it a discoverable? Sounds like it might be discoverable. I don't know. Oh. Women of Ixataka. Sounds like a crime. my brows, so. That feels nice to touch the area. Oh, damn it, I'm back at the beginning. I'm about to go up the pole. Done. Yay. I shall have a look see on the disco. Ah, you were the one who got rid of the blue ones. Tropica. Oh, that's a Tropica. Oh, Cham! An extremely rare gourd found in Ixataka raises an ally's max HP by 200. Wowzer. That's awesome. I might look up if that has other uses before I use it. Woo, slutty time! This is so dangerous. The fact that he's not sitting down is what's, what's irking me, because like, on your boots like that, those corners, you would just fly. Hello, dancing lady. Oh, she's dancing now. That is a very powerful ship you have. I hope one day I will board a ship. I look for comrades to help me get re revenge on Valua. I wrote a letter to Quetia, sent it to the sky. I asked Quetia to send me strong P warriors to aid my cause, which we found at the lighthouse at Sailor's Isle. Uh, did we learn by any chance? I picked it up in the ocean. <gasps> that is the letter I wrote to Quetia. I sent it looking for help. Quetia surely sent you to me. You must be warriors I am waiting for. Please, take me with you. I want to fight against Valua. I am very really strong, but I can dance. And I can lift everyone's spirits with my dancing. Ah, we now have two jesters and I must make a choice. So, Pow uh, raises chance of attacking first, cool. Merida, increase your ship's value. What? What's that? What's that? What? What is that worth? Worth. Right. So the Defenus has uh, gone from a value of. Oh. Okay. Um. Sorry. It's these buttons not being where I expect them to be. So she can up the. Defenus' value from 11 million to 11 million and 1,000. That seems really weird and pointless. Just had a version of safety dance in our head. Uh, you can dance. You can dance. Everybody look at your hands. Okay, so there's two recruits here. Woman Isle? Question mark. I don't even know what to do about that. That, that just feels stupid. 
We can trans if we want to. We can leave dead names behind. With our friends we can trans, but if they won't trap If they're not okay with trans, then they ain't no friends of mine. Hooray, we got another crew. Turn to the Delphinus. Let's see about these pictures people are putting in the good stuff. Ooh, love the hair, Safi. I have very similar uh, eye chain uh, to Zorg. That's really cool. Love the shirt. I don't know who it is, but I love the shirt. Very cool people. Oh, there's a picture out of my remit. Right, was there anything else of import? King's Hideout, Rixis, Moonstone Mountain. How far away is the Isle of Women? Might not be here at all. Because that guy boasts about his uh, incredible eyesight. Um, skies of Arcadia. Isle of Women. Ixanes Village. Oh. Interesting. Oh, the Amazons. I look in a medium sized island directly north of the island where Moonstone Mountain is located. Hmm. Very near the Ixataka and South Ocean border. Alright, head straight south. The shirt is from an artist for a Franco-Belgian comics-inspired RPG. Wow, that sounds cool. Hello, little boat. Tiny boat. Oh, can you please bring me 10 sky shards? Yeah, I have them right now. I fish all the time. Oh, yeah, I love fish. I catch them every day, but they're too hard to catch. Thank you. Take this symbol of my appreciation. Arabic cham! That's how I get an Arabic cham? Oh my god. Wow. The fish have use! Oh, wonderful. I was beginning to worry that I was catching fish just for the fun of it. Which, I would catch fish for the fun of it. But it's always nice when they tie into something, you know? Miss, but weak as shit. Wow, not happening. I should use a special. There we go. Oh, that that did a bloody murder. Wonderful. Good to see him. We love to see him. TVs at work are becoming my arch nemesis. <laughs> too distracting or too full of misogyny? I'm guessing it's football. Ooh, you commissioned Jen for something? That's cool. I did not know. I have not been watching that much lately. I've just been quite ill in the sleep. Unfortunately. <laughs> they never work when they're supposed to. Oh, the TV's at work. Not Jen being on stream and not doing work. <laughs> Supreme distractions. That's also a big thing. 
Oh, you got in there a bit late, Fina. Ica. That was 17 months ago, but a lot's been happening, so it's been a bit delayed. Oh, wow. Oh, yeah. The whole health situation. Yeah, that makes sense. All right. Moonstone Mountain. Kind of on the border between the two. That island? Just gonna have a little look around this general area. This isn't something, really? It's cool as hell. Oh! Treetops. Oh, this is just normal Hoteca. Well, wait. How did I get there so fast? I'm confused. Dead, 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 dead. Well, I guess we'll just kill them too. Oh, no, it missed. Wonderful. They're like, I'm not going there. You're fine, Vice the Daring. He's a sure shot, silly eyed missile man. things up. Uh, let's see. Medium-sized island directly north of the island where Moonstone Mountain is located. Very nearly Ixaka Sun Bullet. Discoveries on the opposite coast of the island from the Greystone Reef located in the second of three notch-like clearings in the rainforest east of the small island. Wow. Following the edge along the rainforest eastern side. Oh, okay. Interesting. So, that island right there, eastern side.
Oh, I'm going along the wrong side. I'll just follow around. Fi 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 Live ready, living like we ain't got time. Woo! That never happens. Oh my god! People are doing the good! Except for Fina, who has the close up, even though she missed. Aha! Ixanes village. A tribe of weirmen that lives on a small island in Ixataka. They are skilled and fearsome warriors. They raid nearby villages twice a year to kidnap men. The numbers of men in nearby tribes have been reduced to almost nothing. Oh, damn. It's a kind of twist on some of the Amazon legends. So the 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 kind of legend of women only island, women only place that must kidnap men for breeding purposes is I feel a little bit uh, we needed to figure out how this island would make any sense. Like first off, they could just get the sperm. It's not necessarily like that locking into. Second, uh, I do feel like some of them could just be trans. <laughs> Maybe they breed that way. Or maybe they don't breed at all. Maybe they just welcome in women when they go there to get away from all the shittery of men. Just thoughts. There we go. I found a dial of women for the, for the man. I'm good about it, but I did find it. Come down, come, come down, Harry. Come on. Down the ladder. Ride the shoe puff. Uh, no, I go this way. Oh, that way is currently not available. Well, balls. Okay, go to the Elder's place. It's a little bit of a walk, I'll be honest. Cool, big fish. Cool. I how straight the back is when climbing like that. I don't know. You! Women only? Maybe you're talking about the village of Ixanes. Yes, that must be it! So there really is a village of only women. I've been searching for it for many years. Thank you. You're the best sailor I know. Take me with you on your ship. I want to travel with you. Really? You joined the crew of my ship? That's right. I'll join you on your crew. Look for someone who could make good use of my incredible eyes. My eyes. I could see the enemy from far away. Other things too. Clear as day. 
this be useful to you? Join the crew as a lookout! Which is a new position, I believe. Oh, there's only three positions left to fill. Oh boy. Tika Tika! Ah, in your active crew, increase your torpedo's hit chance. Oh, I figured it would be hit. Accuracy. Alright, we have got a whole bunch of crew this episode. Wonderful! I need to pee and also make food so I don't die. I like the part where I don't die. Just looking at the sheer amount of hair over on the table. It's wild. Yeah, rest me up. Go for it. Oh! Oh! Clicky sounds! Huh. God, I haven't saved in like an hour. Glad nothing went wrong there. Right, let's have a see who is available for a ride. Oh, I love Jordan Brasco, but I um, don't want to do Overwatch 2. Oh, you know what? Jawstone is playing Baldur's Gate 3. Everyone's favorite freaking thing of the moment. I would like to kind of see how it's uh, how it looks. Oh, no, I still have the too few people in for them to be raided by me. That's delightful. Let's raid Jenny instead, who is doing the art. Yen, 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 yen. Jen might end soon? Oh. Also a raid call? Oh, hang on. Uh, how do I cancel? Back. Did that do it? It did. Okay, good. How long has Jen been going for? See what Jen's up to. Oh, like two hours. Yeah, fair. Probably not then. Ancestors, the humankind odyssey. I don't know that one. Rin Love is playing the thing. Non binary demon dummy mommy. Let's go uh, try raiding Rin Love. Yay! Is it letting you raid this time, Zorb? Is it letting you raid? Maybe just release the bees. Something simple. I can't actually hear Rin over the this, so I'm just gonna go end the game. Yes, that was some emulation. Release the bees! Oh, there's so many of us, wonderful. Zorb, is it letting you do it properly? Uh, two viewers. Well, I count three, so Zorb I'm guessing it's not working for again. Uh, just in case, I will put the link in the Twitch. If you want to come over and say release the bees with me's. Thank you very much, everybody, for hanging out with me and having a lovely fun time. I mean, hopefully you did too. I enjoyed getting to find all the crewmates. Oh, it's running out. Uh, trans... Trans... Uh, trans... Right...